Uh, hey guys, new episode of uh, what was it again? Fire Emblem. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I think I'm losing my mind slowly, <laughs> but it's fine. New episode of Fire Emblem. Let's get started. Okay. Let's uh, restart the chapter so that we know what's happening if somebody missed the last uh, stream or YouTube video. Uh, yeah, let's start. Fire Emblem. Marques Laos has been working with, had been working with Burn against the allies of Lycia. Uh, Roy realizes that the leaders of Lycia, his homeland, can no longer be trusted. Still heading for Ostia, Roy moves through a treacherous mountain pass. So this is gonna be a fire emblem chapter. Hopefully we get some insight about fire emblem. Boss! Our boys just got back from the scouting from scouting the village. Then let's go get our tribute. But boss, something's different today. The army stationed real close to us. They say it looks like the Lycian army. Lycia? Then there's nothing to worry about. They're mostly well, almost wiped out by burn. We can handle a few battered soldiers. You're right, boss. They probably got some valuables on them too. Still, uh, don't get careless. Ready then, let's mop these losers boys. loser boys. A villager is here to see you, Lord Roy. Hey, you just wait a second. Are you Lord Roy of House Frey? Yes, how may I help you? Lord, I beg of you, please rid us of these bandits terrorizing our village. Bandits, you say? There's a group of bandits that made their base in the nearby cliffs. Where, where, where are the castle guards? They fled once the, they heard that the Lycian army was defeated by Burn. We villagers are left on our own. Our days are spent in fear of the bandit attacks. We have no one else to ask. Please help us. Lord Roy, we must keep pace towards Ostia. Yeah, we're not going towards Ostia. But we can't simply ignore the people in need. You're joking. You'll help us? Thank you. Please use the gate to the west. It'll take you right to the castle. Thank you. I'll arrange for the gate to be opened when you give me the signal. Well, yes, we're going to the castle to drive off the bandits. Sorry, youthful energy. Where does it come from? It comes from youth. Okay, let's start by... Okay, let's take Marcus to this village and visit. If you can, try to occupy forts. That'll stop some reinforcements from showing up. Okay. And Lance can visit this village. I was there and an orphan was taken. The women riders of Burn were terrifying enough, but then a dragon engulfed the Lycian army in flame. Well, Elimini, please tell me it was a dream. So Elimini is their... Uh, is their... goddess, I guess? Oh, uh, let's go forward with our army. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just... Like, this wall won't open until we uh, give them the signal. So, I'm just gonna leave these two. I'm just gonna leave Marcus here. And we'll go the long way because we need the EXP. Uh, yeah, and that's about the gist of it. <laughs> We're EXP hogs now. Let's move everybody forward. Let's keep the healer a little back. Uh, you go here. They don't have archers on top, do they? No, they don't. Uh, so I can hopefully fly her here. Let's just not fly very close to the sun in case we burn. My healer here and you wait here. I didn't change his weapon from a hand axe to something else, but we attacked. So, yay! <laughs> a 
Okay, the hand axe is helping out. <laughs> not a lot, but yeah. We did not need to attack. It's fine. Okay. Thank you, Dorothy. Please tell Brother Saul as well. I will, Father Yoda. But where did Saul run off to now? I'm supposed to guard him if he keeps disappearing. Uh, but the Saul, I appreciate the offer, but not tonight. Come on, don't be like that. We can sit by the fire in the dark of night as I soothe Lee. As I soothe you with my calming sermons. <laughs> there you are, Saul. <laughs> Wonderful, Dorothy. I can take my leave now. No, don't go! Oh man, look what you've done now, Dorothy. That expression on your face scared her away. This is my normal look. <laughs> Saul, you can't try to woo every girl you meet. <laughs> You make it sound like a bad thing. I simply offer my helping hand to any poor souls in need. <laughs> then why do you always offer to give your sermons at night? <laughs> well, putting that aside, did you have some reason for interrupting my good work? <laughs> oh, right. The Lycian army is apparently somewhere close to here. Truly, is Princess Jennifer still with them? Yes, if the reports from the Saint Eliminate Church are accurate, then we must make haste. Let's join them. What's the matter, Dorothy? You only want to join them because Princess Yennever is said to be so beautiful. Don't be ridiculous. Come on, hurry now. Yes, let's go. So, they're not gonna help me fight? Let's try killing him. We failed. It's fine. Uh, where's my archer? My archer is way back here. Yeah, he's not gonna make it. Lug. Lug can come here and attack this guy with fire. Whoa, a critical hit. I'll take it. That's an okay, uh, level up. I wish he'd have leveled up his magic, but... Yeah, I guess beggars can't be choosers. So, Alan. There's Alan, there's Rutger, there's Roy, and then there's Reed. Let's actually kill him with Alan. Oh, wait. Can we kill him with Chad? Yes, we can, but... Yeah, sure, let's try and kill with Chad. It's like the start of the game. Even if Chad dies... We can try again. Okay. Uh, let us bring Alan... Alan can survive three attacks, right? I think we can kill him with Wade. Okay, this is really good. Let's see who else. Let's bring our archer closer. Uh, do we need to heal anyone? I don't see that we do. Uh, let's... Uh, is it the village? This whole area is really perfect for bandits. It's no wonder they appeared. They can cross mountains and a bandit on a peak is a force to be reckoned with. Dreadful. Just dreadful. Yeah, I don't even know what to do. Like, I don't think I should be opening this right now. Yeah, let's just stay here with Marcus and let's go away with Lance. Let's move up, move up, and let's take the fort, and let's move him up, let's move up our healer on the back, what else? Alan can go here, hopefully Alan doesn't die, like I said healer's on the back, what else? 
you can attack him but you'll probably die because all of these guys will attack us so you actually come here and wait a turn who else is left Carlinus. you just stand back i guess Okay, he's attacking Chad because Chad has low... Uh, Chad is the weakest link, let's say. Lack of a better word. Take that. Oh, let's see if we can use our... Okay, the archers are coming. We need to be careful of the archers. So let's start with our archer. Uh, how much damage can you do? Five. Let's see if you can do ten damage. No, you can just do five, okay. He has nine health left. Let's miss without archer, I guess? For some reason. Uh... Yeah, let's attack with our guy. Let's hit him with Armor Slayer so that he dies. I really didn't want to do one more turn. One more guy. That's a very bad roll, <laughs> to be honest. Okay, uh, let us go forward. Attack him with an iron axe. Okay, we're good. Let's see if we if the archers can reach us. The archers just might. Yeah, not a good thing. Uh what else can I do? Uh, you can go here. You can go... Oh. Wait. You can go here and fire this guy's ass. Okay. We're good. We're still there. Uh, and let me just... Uh, Let me just uh, configure some of the things so that it's easier for me navigate. Okay. Uh, who else? You can go here and attack. Let's go here and attack this guy and hopefully kill him. Let's see both the attacks hit. They did not. Okay, uh, what else? What else? Uh, Rutger, let's bring him here. I think Alan and Rutger can take care of it, but I really don't want Alan going much forward. So Alan can go here, attack him with the sword because why not oh uh let's actually go here yeah not uh, he's not worth it actually uh let's go here use our iron sword to finish him off Hopefully we don't end up killing Rutger. Hopefully he can hold his own. Marlius come forward. And is anybody injured at all? No, nobody's injured. Fine. Let's take Shauna back here so that she can go wherever later. Lance come for the battle. 
Who else is left? Marcus. And yeah, Marcus, you just stay here. You just stay here. Uh, Ellen, you go a little forward, and you also go a little forward. And we're good. Okay, what I'm afraid will happen is he's gonna... Oh, I, well, what I was afraid was he's gonna kill this guy, somebody else would come, and he's gonna kill that guy, and somebody else would come, and that's how they would damage him, but it's fine. Turns out that's not gonna happen. The archer did come though. <laughs> Okay, let's kill those archers first. Roy can't go to kill the archers. Let's start with Lot. Sure, why not? You can go here and attack this archer. I did not consider that he might need healing and I cannot get to him so I need to kill everybody before... <sighs> before somebody ends up killing him. Uh, let's start with an iron sword. Yeah, let's kill this guy. With Roy. What else? I can... Attack here with Wade. And kill him. Can he get to my guy? No. Can he get to my guy? No. So there are just two people who can get to my guy. Let's go here. Actually first, let's see if anybody else can attack. No, they cannot. So, Alan, you can come here and attack him and kill him off. Hello, Marvel. Uh, sorry, I didn't see your chat. Uh, or you may have just posted it. Thanks for watching my stream. Uh, let's kill him off. Uh, 11. And he's gonna attack me with 10. Yeah, not a good thing if he gets really, really lucky. So let's just move our units forward. Uh, why not you go here so we've killed the two archers so we can risk uh, going here and attacking him with the javelin no we cannot because if he gets really lucky 9 times 2 is 18 and he's gonna kill my person yeah, my person I said it my person and sure let's heal Luke for one did I level up yes I did level two that's a good roll uh, healers having more magic is always good Shauna you go up here for this turn and who else is left yeah marcus you just stay here actually you take care of this house just wait here who else merlinus you go here by the way i'm not perfect in this game so if you have any advice i'll be very happy to listen to it Let's see what else they do. He attacks me. I can't attack back. It's fine. Uh, 
Let's take our focus on this guy. You dare attack me. You dare attack the mighty Rutger. Let's heal him up. Uh, let's attack him with Deke. Deke hasn't seen action in a little while. Die. Okay. That's really good. Weapon level increased. So his weapon level now is B. Which is... Great, I guess? I don't know, like... Uh, let's visit this place. Hold on, before you go, take this lance with you. It was once wielded by a knight called Sir Gant. The stories say he bested many a foe with this lance. So I got a Gant's lance. Send item to Merlius. Let's send... Yeah, let's send the javelin to Merlius because we've already got a javelin. Let's stay away from this person. Actually, maybe Alan can attack. No, let's make Alan go to the woods. Let, let's make him go to the woods. Let's make Roy go to the woods. And let's... Yeah, let's equip the iron sword and not... Uh, other things. Let's bring Lot forward. It, Lot has health, right? Yeah. Just confirming people have health before I just uh, send them to their doom. Uh, so... Let's actually rescue him and go here. Because it'll take a long time for him to go forward. Now Marcus, you actually hide in the forest. Okay. He had a hit of zero. What did he expect would happen? This guy also has a hit of zero. Okay, I'm starting to think I need to bring back uh, one of my... I mean, like, Marcus can take care of these two without a problem, but, like, Marcus doesn't need the HP. So we're gonna do the smart move and run away and bring back Alan so he can fight them. And maybe Shauna, because why not? Until then, we'll use the rest of the army to attack them. Let's start with Lou. Uh, sure, we're gonna kill them anyway, so... And he missed! Uh, what else? What else? Uh... Let's go here and attack him with an iron sword. Yeah. So that was a critical hit. Because Roy is awesome. Uh, let's go forward and attack him with an iron axe. Uh, Let's actually go here and attack him with an iron axe. It doesn't make a difference, but I'll be able to bring somebody from the back if this happens. Where, uh, you know, we end up missing a lot. Iron bow. Die. No, I wish like in this uh, Fire Emblem series we could pick up items because having a steel sword would be awesome. Uh, let's see if Lot can do some damage. Nope. It's fine. Uh, Rutger.
Alan. Chad. Let's go here. We can't heal anybody. Uh, and you... Where do I drop off my lord? My person. You still keep carrying him. Who can I heal? I can heal Lot, but I can't heal Lot. I can heal Alan, but I can't heal Alan. If that makes sense at all. Yeah, you just wait here. It's fine. Okay. That's good. Again, we're running away with Marcus because he really does not need XP. And he doesn't even get XP. If I kill somebody, he gets around like uh, 3 XP, which is like nothing. Okay. This is good. I have enemies to kill. Let's start with the archer. And I... Yeah, sure, why not? Okay. Skill. Yes. This is actually a very good level up. Ah. Chad. Uh, you go here and attack him with a hand axe? No, an iron axe. Yeah, attack him with an iron axe. This way, what we can do is we can bring Chad here and have him kill this guy. Hopefully. And still have Chad safe, cause... And also level up! Ooh, this is a good roll. Okay, so why I wanted Chad here is I could block this path and have Chad safe, uh, because Chad is a very weak unit. Uh, let us take our uh, mage here and attack this guy. Okay. Uh, what else can we do? Uh, Deke, Wade. Uh, sure. Let's take Roy here and kill this guy. Die. He does not level up, but he's close to leveling up. Let us put our healer here and drop this guy here. Let us... What else can we do? Let us bring Wade in here and attack. Let's bring Deke here and attack this guy. The Deke's killed him. That's good. Like, Deke is also already a very high level. Like, he's level 8, but he does level up. Uh, whereas Marcus is level 1. Paladin and he doesn't like he doesn't get exp at all And when I say at all I mean at all so let's bring Her here and let's bring Lance back down so that we can attack using the three people uh, Can we heal somebody here we can We can heal Chad we can heal lot Let's heal lot Okay, what else? Uh, Rutger and Alan. We can use Alan to go here. And... Iron Lance this guy? Yeah, I Lance this guy. Because Lances are better than Swords in this game. I don't know if it's in general, because I haven't used a Lance or a Sword. Let's use uh, him. To maybe kill him? No, we're not able to. Maybe Rutger can kill him? Sure. Uh, 
sure. Let's bo let's use both of them to actually kill this guy. I'm not wasting Rutger's killing edge on a bandit. Rutger leveled up. That's a very bad roll. Just two increments. Let's. I don't even know. Let's iron axe him. Hopefully we hit. We do hit. And we level up. Wait. Very good. That's an okay roll. Okay. I can get behind that. Uh, who else is left? Merlius. You come here. And you wait. Okay. Wade gets more experience. And his weapon levels increased. That's very good. Okay. Okay. Not cool, dude. Not cool. I mean, I, I also came to kill you, but still not cool. Let's start with attacking him with an iron sword or a javelin or an iron sword. Because why not? Let's see. How much damage does Marcus do? Marcus do, does a considerable amount of damage. How far can he go? He can go here. He can go here. Shana is injured. Yeah, let's run away with Shana. Let's heal. I can't even get to her. Darn it. It's fine. Uh, Alan has a lot. Yeah, let's just wait here. An attack with Alan. Hopefully. And let's go back here. Uh, let's see what's in... Actually. Uh, yeah, lot. You go here. And... Look at the merch. Because I took a halberdier. Uh, is it trade? Yeah, so I took a halberd from this guy. Ooh, Lot can use the halberd. That's good to know. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, yeah, you wait here. You actually go here and buy stuff from the vendor. So what we're going to do is we're going to buy some door keys, around uh, 10 door keys. Okay, not 10 door keys, 6 door keys. Is this base FE6? Uh, what about Chad? What about Chad? Uh, this is, I think this is Fire Emblem The Binding Blade and it's the translated version. So, uh, I don't think Binding Blade was released in English. I might be wrong here because it's been a long time since I played Fire Emblem, but this is Binding Blade. It might be 6, I don't know, but it's the Binding Blade that was released in 2002 in Japan. Uh, so, if I'm wrong, uh, correct me, but... As the title says, it's the Binding Blade. Like, Fire Emblem goes back to 1988. Uh, prepare to never use Roy. Why not? Is Roy that bad or is it because Roy is an essential character and I don't want to use him because he might die? Uh, let's heal.
He promotes late and has shit stats. Yeah, but he's he has to be in uh, he has to be in every uh, battle, right? So I have somebody who I cannot remove from battle, and like even though he might have shit stats, I have to use him. Or is it that later on we can remove him from the battle? Or later on we can remove him from rounds? Because I played the later Fire Emblem. You can just use Shanna to carry him. But why? Like, he takes up one space. Why not use him? If we, if we have him. Like, I, I understand... Uh, the need to not use him if like because he's a main character and not uh, really uh, like he might die if we uh, put him in a stressful situation but like he's always here so we have to improve his stats regardless just in oh he's bad in general well, he's been killing a lot of people, so I don't know what you mean by bad. So if I go here and just iron sword him, like he does 20 damage with 100% accura accuracy. That's really good. Isn't it? At least I feel so. And he levels up. But I'm getting really bad rolls, though. <laughs> oh well, let's just see if you can get lucky with him. Let's see! Uh... Javelin, Iron Lance... Sure, let's just use the Lance and see if we can get lucky. We did get lucky. With a 57% hit rate. I actually should be improving Bors because he's really like he's like a tank and okay let's keep moving uh, we need to heal Alan up because he's gonna be at the center because I'm gonna put him at the center actually <laughs> Uh, so, Alan, you sit here and block everything that comes our way. You can attack this guy. Okay. So close. Let's see if Shanna can finish him off. Uh, can he get to Shanna? He can. Yeah, let's just heal Shanna. Rutger died to this boss. You know what happened last stream? Uh, Shanna had one health and I forgot she had one health. I forgot to heal her and I took her to attack a bandit who, who just had two health. I was like, hey, let's improve Shanna. And she missed and he killed him. I had to restart because Rutger has killing blade and he killed two of my units before I could recruit him because he appears out of nowhere and he like you don't have time to prepare he just comes and starts uh, critical hitting your units <laughs> they are like if you if you if you just look at this uh, killing edge it has a 30 crit chance and with Rutger it's hi it's higher it's actually 35 so yeah uh, okay uh, let's just leave Rutger here for a while let's bring Deke forward let's bring everybody for I just don't want uh, somebody to get really really badly injured and Rutger is already low on XP, so I don't want to take him forward if he's gonna die on me. So let's wait here. Anybody else? Yeah, I'm not improving Marcus at all. Like, even if I kill one person, he just takes three XP. I've seen someone get 202 crit with him. Wow. 
So he would crit every time? That's... That's... That's broken. <laughs> that's so broken. He levels up. Very good roll. I need a defense on him. It's fine. We can survive a hand axe. Yes, but also yes. Okay. So close. We're so close to leveling up. Okay, now we level up. Now we level up. Come on, good roll. Okay, this is an okay roll. I can appreciate it. Uh, let's see if we can kill him with Alan. We can. Let's kill him with Alan. Uh, what else? Uh, so I need to kill this bandit in one hit. Yeah, let's first deal with this bandit. Uh, did I heal Shanna? Yes, I did. Shanna, can you go here and maybe kill him? You cannot. Shanna is not at all good. But I need a unit who can actually traverse the land really fast because that's useful sometimes but I don't know I have to improve her somehow so oh, why not let's take her to battle uh, he has 20 health let's see if Roy can kill him with a rapier no what about Deke Yes, Deke can kill him. The game hates Pegasus Knights. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. Like, I think they were uh, so afraid that the Pegasus Knights would be OP if you made them uh, powerful. Because they can travel anywhere. So they had to uh, make the Pegasus Knights less OP. And they took a really weird uh, way of making it less OP. <laughs> I don't know. And I just realized I put I'm I'm putting Rudger in danger. Does this guy have? Uh, he has a hand axe. Oh, this is the killer axe you were talking about, <laughs> Ezreal son. Uh, okay. So I should be very, very careful of the killing axe. Thanks for, thanks for the warning. Uh, I think I can take uh, an axe from him with my buffed unit. Let's attack him with the iron sword. Let's actually go here and attack him with the iron sword. And sure, Marcus gets to kill this guy because this is being very stressful and I don't want it to be really stressful. Do you play FEH? What's FEH? Uh, Fire Emblem Heroes? Uh, if it's multiplayer, I don't play it because I really, uh, I really hate grinding in multiplayer. Because it gets, like, most of them go, get to the point where it's, like, uh, free to play. Uh, sorry, pay to win. And I really start hating games after that. So I, I, I just don't start with them. Is FEH also the also a grind fest uh, later? Or is it okay? If it's okay, I'll be, like, I, I'm, I'm really happy to try playing it. How much health does we have? No one's ever survived the blow from my axe. Hey, you wanna see why? You don't have to grind much when you don't go too hard on arena. 
Yeah, uh, this is one of the things I don't like that a lot of people like, and this is this is really personal. Like, uh, I've seen a lot of people actually demand this in mobile games, but what I don't like is when uh, they try to make a single player experience into a multiplayer experience where you can actually uh, do arenas and stuff because in the end it gets to a point where like if you're playing casually like I do uh, it gets to a point where you can't uh, progress because people in the arena are like uh, really really OP I had that happen with uh wait what was the there was a card game i used to play i forgot uh, the name uh with the gems and everything and it happened to me there and after that i swore off playing uh playing multiplayer games like they're fun and i play them with friends but i won't uh, play a multiplayer game where you can't play with friends oh uh, i'll uh, I'll actually try one if you're recommending it. Uh, it's worth trying once, I guess. Uh, let's see, Deke. If you attack him, he does 13 damage. But he can switch to the other thing. Yeah, gems. I forgot the name of the game. Uh, it's from Blizzard. So how much does Killer Axe have? Sorry, uh, how much uh, crit? Okay, Killer Axe has a 30 crit. So I can't have my units get close to him. I... Yeah, Hearthstone. It was Hearthstone. Uh, I'll just attack him from afar and see. I didn't he does 16 damage! Oh, he does. Thank god he missed. I didn't check. And I just attacked him with my weak unit. It's fine. Just breathe. It'll be fine. Yeah, Hearthstone. Uh, what, what started ha happening in Hearthstone, for me at least, was that they would have really OP cards. Which I'd never seen before. And it got to the point where... Maybe I was just bad, but I started losing a lot. Uh, but yeah. Uh, okay, now that you've scared me, I really don't want to attack him any way other than... Yeah, hot. Like, for people who pay, play regularly... Uh, None of the games are pay to win because you're paying regularly and you can grind it off. But if you're just a casual player, then it becomes a pay to win mechanic because you can't have enough time to just get enough stuff in. I really don't want to take Roy in because he might die. Uh, yeah, so let's bring Roy here so that he's not attacked. Let's heal our guy yeah Rudger is really not healed at all so I can try to heal him and then make him attack so why not I can actually wear him down, like he has 20 health. Uh, I can wear him down with uh, with uh, ranged units. Like, go here. And ax him. Like, keep... Uh, keep uh, hitting him with ranged units. Like, I know for a fact that these guys don't leave their castles so my bowman is out of the question what about Alan nah so Rutger can you 
critical hit him with your killing edge. <sighs> 14. Rescue Lug. Yeah, but Lug can't die. Like, he has 17 health. The highest Dory can hit with a ranged attack is 16. So, Lug is fine. And actually, we healed Bors, so why not just take Bors and attack? Oh. That's why. I think we're fine here. Yeah, I think we're fine here the next turn. I know Lug has low defense, but I saw that he has 16 attack against Lug, and Lug has 17 uh, HP. So Lug will survive. So he's fine for one turn. That, that That's what I was saying. So yeah, let's uh, finish this turn off, and next turn we can attack with our ranged units and just kill Dory off. Yeah, let's just pray. <laughs> let's just pray. And he attacks Bors. I'm good with him attacking Bors. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Uh, we can attack with Lug. He'll do 10 attack. And if he gets hurt, we can heal him up. He misses. So this is what I said. He has 16 attack against Lug. And Lug has 17 health, so Lug will be fine uh, regardless. Uh, Bors, not so much. So this guy has 13 health. I can finish him off with Rutger. So before I finish him off with Rutger, and hopefully I do, let's just attack him with random units. Uh, no, let's just finish him off. Uh, let's heal... Uh, let's go. Yeah, let's heal uh, Bors. Luck is actually really good against... Yeah, Bors will die if he stays. That's true. I need to move Bors to a safer location. Lot can survive. No, Lot can't survive. <laughs> Actually, Lot can. He'll just hit Lot once. So 14 times 2 is 28. Yeah, Lot can survive. Let's try raising Lot's XP by 1. Okay, Lutger, you're up. My main man. Let's see if you can... Cool, cool. Let's let's risk it. One attack. He missed. Okay. No, I don't want to die. But you're dead. <laughs> That's what you get for banditries. Level up. Level six, and we get a nice roll. And we have nothing else to do. Let's actually just use Ellen to heal somebody so she gets some EXP. Uh, who can you heal, Ellen? Let's heal Bors. And let's just capture and be done with it. Okay. This was a little stressful, but we made it through. Lord Roy. A priest from St. Alimony Church wants to audience with you, and Princess Genevieve. He knew that Princess Genevieve was with us. Yes, I can't imagine how. Me neither. I'll see him alone. Roy, I will be fine. I wish to meet this priest. <laughs> Princess, tensions between my brother and the church have worsened as of late. I know! She's very stupid, but, like, she's not, uh... Like, she's trying to help us in a way, but, like, she's really stupid in other ways. I don't know. Uh, I do not believe that they would attempt anything underhanded, okay? I see. Well, in us, allow this priest in. So this guy's like, hey, come meet me at night and I'll read you some sermons. <laughs> so, anywho, Lord Roy, it is a pleasure to meet you at last. 
I am Saul, an acolyte of St. Alumni Church. Pleased to meet you. Oh, and you must be Princess Jennifer. You are as beautiful as the rumors say. Pardon me? Um, forgive me. <laughs> Your Highness, I wish to know the location of the Fire Emblem. You have it with you, do you not? How did you know that? Burns Head Church tells us the Fire Emblem disappears from the Shrine of Seals. And you also went missing exactly at the same time. I was sent by the church to confirm the truth. <laughs> yeah, Saul's like getting really horny with her. It's fine. Why did you take the fire emblem? I wish to stop my brother. Your brother? Zafil, the king of Bern. Yes. Do you know what the fire emblem is used for? I don't know. It's a key that awakens a sword that was used to slay the dragons long ago. That was what my father told anyways. I am unsure how exactly the fire emblem or the swords work. My brother seemed to worry about the fire emblem falling into enemy hands though. Okay, extraordinarily so. So you took the fire emblem to make the king believe it fell into enemy hands. All in an attempt to stop his conquest. That's smart, in a way. Yes, but the war continued anyway. But that's also dumb. Because her brother will be like, somebody stole uh, uh, the thing that's going to defeat me. So I better attack fast before they get the thing. I don't know what the true ending is. Like, I haven't played this game for around 8 or 9 years. Like, I played other Fire Emblem games. I don't know the path to true ending is. I I I'll search for it. I'll Google it maybe. Or you might tell me. But for now, I'm just playing it as is. I'm just not using save states because that would be really cheap, in my opinion at least. But apart from that, I'm open to any other suggestions you might have. Um, what will you do now? And must I reveal my plan at this moment? Okay, you might want to look up weapon conditions. Some of them are so stupid. Sure, why not? Uh, Ah, so your highness has a plan. Yes, I have not given up hope on settling this war without further bloodshed. I see. In that case, I will accompany you on your journey. If Roy allows it, I have no objections. Thank you, Roy. Of course, princess. Cool. Let's save.